It's time to wish the royal family well and good health. King Charles is due to receive treatment in hospital now for an enlarged prostate, not a serious health issue and Buckingham Palace has uh, been emphatic in pointing out that the condition is benign and uh, that also that the condition is quite common in men in their 60s and above. Buckingham Palace said in its statement that in common with thousands of men each year, the king has sought treatment for an enlarged prostate. And that announcement came within just a couple of hours, a word that his daughter-in-law, Princess Kate, the Princess of Wales, has had abdominal surgery. And these medical issues do mean that senior members of the royal family will be off their public royal duties for some time to come, certainly over the next few weeks or so. The king had a number of engagements planned at Dumfries House on Thursday and Friday. These have now been cancelled or, as the palace says, postponed. They do appear to have been some symptomatic issues that prompted immediate steps from the palace to make this announcement for the king to seek treatment. King Charles is due to attend hospital next week for corrective treatment. Buckingham Palace has said that the king's engagements and public engagements, that is, will be postponed also uh, following the procedures for his period of recuperation. The palace says that it expects the period of absence from public duties to be a short one. The announcement from the palace is said to have a purpose beyond just informing people about the health condition of the king. It is intended to encourage men to step forward for treatment for a condition that is common but also commonly ignored by a number of men for quite long periods. And so the Royal Watch among people who do keep it and in Britain and also around the world will for now stay focused on health bulletins from the palace and no doubt good wishes for a quick recovery for King Charles and for Princess Kate.